Good morning and welcome to have morning coffee with Kimara. Today I want to talk to you about uh, how to put a target to your language learning. Many times when we learn a language, we just say that uh, we want to learn the vocabulary or we want to learn the grammar of that language. But it sounds really like an endless task to learn a vocabulary of one language or, or to learn the grammar of one language totally, everything in it. So, I suggest that instead of thinking that I want to master this, for example, particular uh, grammar thing, I want to master partitivi, instead think what kind of situation you want to master. For example, if you want to master a situation where uh, when you go to a shop that you can communicate in that language or if you want to uh, order doctor's appointment for example or if you want to book a table in a restaurant what kind of language you need in that situation what kind of vocabulary and what kind of grammar you need in that situation and then you can take that as a, as a target instead of like mastering one particular grammar thing, for example, in all the situations. Think of first mastering the situations where you are confident in using the language. You also, of course, have to think that what do you study the language for? Why do you study that language? Do you study it for travel? Or do you study it for business? Or do you study it because you live in that country, for example? All these require a bit different, uh, different kind of language, different kind of uh, situations where you deal with that language, right? So, uh, think, put a target for you, for example, for every day, for one week, for one month, what is the target? What kind of situations I could use my language? And like I said before, the most important thing, start to use the language immediately, right away. When you can say only a few things, start to use the language. For me, it's really difficult to understand if somebody says that for example, yeah, I was um, I wanted to have a Chinese group. I wanted to have friends in my Chinese group so we could do different kind of exercises together instead of just learning one to one with the teacher. So uh, I was trying to find some friends to learn Chinese with me. But one answer that I got from my friend was that uh, I'm a bit scared to go with you in the same group because I'm not in that level yet where I could use the language. So what do you do with the language if you don't use it? Learn it like the Latin or something? Where, for what do you really study the language for if you don't use it? So my point is, think about your targets. What are your targets? today, this week, this month. What kind of situations you want to use your language? And then you can start learning.